guys welcome to my channel if you are new here please click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you will be updated every time a new video is uploaded in this channel so for today's video I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to recover or restore deleted videos so on my case na delete ko ang video na to accidentally and i found out na kapag na delete pala yung isang video mo yung views na nagain ng video na yon ay mawawala din meaning um, bababa din yung views mo but if you were able to recover the video mababalik yon yung pinaka original na views na nagain niya, mababalik yan. So, ganun yung sistema ni YouTube. Okay, so for now, let's move on to the first step. So, we will go to the help option of YouTube. You can find it here, the help option, or here, help, the help option. Cup, then, click that. After that, kapag klinik mo yung help option, may lalabas na help window. So, on the search help, type non-profit. Bakit non-profit? Kasi, um, yung YouTube channel ko is hindi pa siya monetized. So, that means... We are under the YouTube non-profit program. Kasi, hindi pa monetize yung YouTube channel natin. So, after typing the non-profit, kailangan makita nyo to. Itong YouTube non-profit program of review. Click that. Okay. Then, hanapin natin yung program features niya. Here. Okay, so as a YouTube non-profit program partner, you have access to these features specifically designed for partners. So, dito tayo sa dedicated technical support. Since we need a technical support. Okay, click that and then scroll down. So, we're here to support YouTube non-profit program partners. With any issue setting up your non-profit channel on YouTube, learn how to contact us. So, we need to click the contact us link. Okay, so, mapupunta tayo dito. Click the, bot the contact button below to tell us about an issue you're having and get dedicated email support to help resolve it so we need to click this button contact us okay so contact youtube non-profit support scroll down so here kailangan fill up natin yung mga information na kailangan kailangan para makapag send tayo or may submit natin yung concern natin YouTube. So, we wait to enter your name. So, please enter your name. So, in this field, I just put my YouTube channel, the name of my YouTube channel. Kim Riano. Okay? So, and here on the organization's name, actually, I just put uh, NA not applicable so they also need your channel URL so paano mo malalaman ko ano yung channel URL natin so balik tayo sa YouTube channel mo okay then punta tayo sa settings then you have to go to advanced view advanced settings so dito natin makikita yung channel url so makikita mo dito yung 
user ID, channel URL, yung custom URL mo. Ayan. So, we just need to copy this. Click copy. And then, paste it here. Paste. Okay. So, nandito na yung channel URL mo. Next is, you have to enter your non-profit registration number. So, hindi ko alam kung ano ang ibig sabihin nila dito. But, I just put random numbers to fill this up. Uh, we, we will use um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay. That will do actually. Then, okay. So, you, they also you need YouTube partner username. So, still I don't have any. I just put my channel name. Okay. Then, kailangan din nila ng YouTube email address. So, kailangan nila ng YouTube email address kasi dito sila magre-reply. So, kailangan yung email address na ilalagay mo dito is active. At nabubuksan mo. Kasi magsisend sila dito ng response nila. Then, next is if this issue affects a particular video, please specify the video here. So, para ma-specify mo ang video, kailangan i-enter mo yung 11-digit video ID only. Your video ID is the 11 characters following question mark V equals in your video URL. So, yung tinatawag na URL, it is the uniform resource locator of a certain page on the internet. So, lahat ng bagay sa internet may URL. Okay? So, makikita natin yung URL dito sa taas. So, ito yung tinatawag na URL. So, dito sa option na to, kailangan daw natin i-input yung 11-digit video ID. So, kailangan alam mo yung URL ng video na na-delete mo. On my case, I was able to to um, check the URL kasi every time na mag-upload ako ng video sa YouTube, sinishare ko rin siya kay Facebook and then pinapost ko rin doon yung URL. So, okay, hanapin natin yung video na yon dito sa Facebook account ko. Okay, medyo matagal na kasi yon kaya medyo mag-i-scroll tayo. Okay. So, isa din yun sa mga recommendation ko, kapag may mga in-upload kayong video, dapat magkaroon din kayo ng list ng URL nila para if in case yung mga ganitong situation is mangyari, mabilis nyo mariretrieve yung video. Especially kapag hindi ka pa monetize. Kasi, sa pagkakaalam ko, may ibang may ibang support para sa mga monetize na na YouTube channel. So, sa non-profit, wala pa masyado. Pero sa mga monetize na, medyo mas mabilis sila, mas mabilis nilang ma ipapaalam kay YouTube yung mga concerns kasi may dedicated creator support na sila doon eh. Okay, so malapit na tayo, nandito 'yon. Okay. Actually, ito na yung bagong kasi nung na-delete yung video ko, in-upload ko ulit siya. So ito 'yon. Pero nung na na-recover ko na yung pinaka-original video, pre-private ko na yung video na 'yon. Okay, so dito. So, ito yung URL ng video kanto. So, ang kailangan lang daw na ilagay is yung 11-digit video ID after the question mark and V. So, equal. So, ang ikakapi lang natin ay ito lang. So, 11 lang daw. So, hanggang dito na tayo. 1, ano na, na, na. 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Hanggang dito lang tayo. Ah, ah wait. Start tayo dito sa W. So, i-copy muna natin to. Copy. Then, balik tayo dito. And, paste. So, since ang kailangan lang nila is a 11-digit ID number, a video number, after the question mark V equals N, so ito lang, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Ayan. So, yun yung kailangan niya. After that, um, you have to state a short summary of issue. So, pwede mong i-type na I accidentally deleted my video and I want it recovered. Thank you. Thank you. Hoping I am hoping that you can help me with this. So, kung may gusto pa ibang sabihin, pwede nyo ring i-specify dito. Submit an attachment. Actually, hindi na ako nag-submit ng file. Then, reviewin mo na lang kung okay na yung mga nilagay mo. Then, you can click the submit button. Okay? So, yun. So, kapag naklik mo na yung submit button, um, maghihintay ka na for 24 hours. Kasi yung sa akin, yung, yung confirmation nila is na-receive ko in less than 24 hours. Doon sa Gmail account na binigay ko sa kanila. At ito yung response nila sa akin. Papakita ko mismo sa inyo yung response ni ng YouTube support for non-profit. Okay. Loading. Papakita ko sa inyo yung email yung create dito ito, ito yon creator support at youtube.com so ayan so na receive ko yung reply in less than 24 hours so ito yung sinabi sa akin hi kim thanks for reaching out i understand you want to reinstate a video so, pag sinabi natin reinstate is recover or to para or yan ma recover ulit yung na delete na video Especially if it's one of your most viewed video. Kasi inindicate ko dun sa, sa message na yung video na yun, yun yung may pinakamaraming views that time. Let me help you with this. Since this is a sensitive issue, kindly fill up the form with the necessary details. Ayan. So, ito yung mga details na hiningi niya sa akin. Yung link to specific video, yung URL ng video. Please certify that you are the owner of this video. Ayon. Please certify that you are requesting the YouTube team to reinstate this deleted video on your behalf. Mark. So then, okay. So nagreply nagreply ako dito. So kinapi paste ko lang ito. Copy. Then, ayon. Ata na yung uh, reply ko sa kanila, yung link ng video I certify na yung video na yon is ako yung owner and then I request, I certify na na request ko sa kanila na i-reinstate yung na-delete ko na video so, nag unang nag sila sa akin nag-email is 6.14am November 27 nag-reply ako ng umaga and then I received their feedback in the evening. Ayan. So, ito na yung na-reinstate na video. Great 
great uh, great hearing from you thank you for all the information i have a good news we were able to reinstate your video don't hesitate to contact me if you have any other questions so yon yon yung mga yan na yon so pagka send ng email na yan nandito na din yung video then pagka check ko sa youtube account ko nandun na din siya naibalik na rin siya ayan so those are the simple steps on how to recover your deleted video on your YouTube channel, especially kapag hindi ka pa monetize. Okay? So, I hope na nakatulong yung video na to sa inyo. And, please, don't forget the, to click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that updated kayo sa mga susunod ko pang video. Thank you so much for watching.